Fatima says, is it okay to perform salah on bed? So Fatima is not asking about the ruling of praying while lying down for someone who's bedridden, for example. She's asking about a person standing on the bed itself and offering prayer rather than praying on the ground. The most authentic opinion is that your elevation, your height, your clearance of the ground does not impact your prayer. And this is why we pray while riding on a bus, which is a meter or so above the ground, or riding on a boat, which is on water, or while we are on board a plane 37,000 feet above sea level. There's no problem in that. Then what is the issue then? The issue is whether the surface you're standing on is taking the same ruling of a solid ground or not. Because most of beds have mattresses on them. And when you stand on a mattress, you find that your foot goes down, which means that the surface itself is not hard. And this means that when I put my head to prostrate, my head and hands are as if they are floating. And they're not stable on something that is solid. And hence, scholars say that the prayer on such surfaces are not, uh, the prayer is not um, valid. Likewise, when you have these spongy uh, ma uh, prayer mats, they are selling now in the, in the markets. For those who have knee joint pains, so for them to go on their knees on the ground, if it's solid, it hurts and they cannot prostrate, they cannot sit. So they made this foam, a prayer mat that is this thick, which is made of foam or sponge like material. So when you prostrate, it's so soft that has a padding that would not make you touch the ground actually. And this praying on it is also not permissible because when you put your forehead, you're not actually placing it on the ground, but rather it is somewhere floating uh, uh, in between. So to answer your question, Fatima, if the mattress is really hard that when you place your forehead, it doesn't go down rather it stays like a hard surface, then the prayer is valid, inshallah.